and welcome to Board Game Nights of the Round Table, to where until we get a budget or tables or a rectangle. I'm Chris. And I'm Chase. And today we're playing... Everdale! My little Everdale, to be specific. So, uh, to play Everdell, first of all, uh, Chase is playing the, uh, who are you playing as? The butterflies. You're playing as the butterflies, and I am these lizard people. Uh, the goal of the game is to have the most victory points. Um, you acquire victory points by sending your workers out to collect resources and then buying cards. The cards will then, then join your settlement. Uh, after four rounds, the game is over. Uh, so we'll have multiple turns in a round, uh, usually three turns because we'll send our workers out. Uh, then we can buy uh, resource. We can, we'll send you send your worker out to a place. You can buy whatever you can afford, one card that you can afford, and then after all that's done, the sun token will come to me, and we'll start a new phase. Simple enough, right? So we'll just talk through how we're what's going on. But essentially, the goal is just to have the most points at the end. Um, these are little things for your parade here. Uh, for this one. You have to have five buildings, doesn't matter which. Uh, Chase has an advantage here because he uh, we gave him a fort, which is a building, and we gave him a captain, which is a critter. So five buildings takes this one, five critters takes this one, and these things will go down. So the first person who claims it gets six points, and then after that it's five points. Uh, this one is just have one of each of the uh, building type, or one of each of the card types, uh, the paw print, the uh, flower, the, the green twig, uh, the uh, traveling sack, and the scroll. And this is have three of any type of things except for the, the, the leaf kind. Uh, we agreed that Chase is going to go first. He got, since he's the uh, younger player, he's got the captain and the fort, and he's got uh, one of each resource to start out with. Yeah, and, and he gets to go first. So um, we're yeah. just going to roll the dice. These dice will change every turn. Only one critter can go on these spots where these resources, any number of critters can go on there. So, two of everything. Two wild, yep. Two of everything. So, I'm going... And then one of each. Two wild and one of each. Okay. See, only two oh, of them. So, before things go, by the way, uh, you roll the dice, and then you're going to gather goodies. So, any of these green things activate, so you're going to get one of these victory points, which is going to go here. And then what resource do you want? I want... You want some resin. See, I get everything. No, 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 no. You only get one of, well, you, you get to choose. It's any one resource. Yeah. So, you went over here, you get two of any, so what, what else are you going to grab? Um, this. There. Okay, are you going to buy a card? Yeah. So it take this is has the same so I can. Yeah, it's that, a building. Yeah, it's a building. It takes the building to do it. So you're gonna it. pay the cost. So you're gonna pay a twig and a resin for the jail. Yeah. So. Okay. And the jail for every critter you buy from now on gives you one of any resource. I love it. I love it. So then the jail. we immediately replace the card. So and I put this Caleb back. Caleb the farmer. <laughs> he looks silly. Okay. Um. I am a screw elite too. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go to this die here and take the one of any resource. So I got that, I got a twig, and I get a resin. And I'm not gonna buy a card right now. So I kinda of wanna save my resources for something. Mm-hmm. Mm okay. So it's my turn. Yes, sir. So, so I can't go anywhere but well, you can go to one of these spaces if you want. Well, Daddy, you be gone. We're supposed to play all of the dice. 
No, we only play with the amount of players. Okay. Yep, so we're so doing two players, so we need to do two dice. I'm going to go here. Nope, nope, I'm there. You can't go there. Okay, correct. So put them on the resin spot. Mm. You're going to grab some more resin? One yeah. resin, okay. So when you go here, you'll no, grab wait, one, wait, of each, wait, one of the resources. Oh, well, um. then put your character by the twig. <laughs> I... Okay, are you going to play something now? I'm gonna, and I'm gonna buy the secret hideout. The hideout. Okay, so these little red cards here. Um, gonna put my thing back. Well, you wanna put it here so you just keep track of your buildings. So these red cards here, they um, they activate whenever you put your critter on there. But so I couldn't put a critter on there. Only Chase can put critters on there. Yeah, because I got oh. it, and I got a secret hideout. Oh, we got a train. Oh, yes, that's my favorite one. That's my favorite okay. one. I got a train. Well, that looks pretty good. I wonder if I should buy that. Um, Daddy. Well, you can't afford it anyway for now. Yeah, because you don't have a car. <laughs> you have well. to have that. I'm going to put this guy over here on the resin to take another resin, but I think I'm going to go ahead and buy the train. I'm not trying to block you or no. be mean. I'm just going to, but it's a card that actually looks kind of handy. So these cards activate whenever uh, you buy them, and then they activate every turn, every round. So hey, look, there's the queen. She costs four. That's the king. I'm sorry, that's the king. He doesn't do anything special, but he does give you a lot of victory points. Um, so then I can pay the resource. So I'm going to go ahead and pay the berry. Um, you know what? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and pay the berry and get a resin. So now I have two resins. Okay, it's your turn, son. Okay. You got one more worker. One more worker. You're blocking my path. I'm... I need some resin. Well, you can go there. Any number of creatures can go here because of all the footprints. So you can go get some more resin if you want. Or you could go here and get a resin and a victory point. Mm -hmm. Only one guy can go there. So here's your victory point. We have fives. We'll, we'll make change if we need to. Okay, so are you going to buy a card? I don't think you well, can. I want to yep, buy that. So you're going to wait. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's see. I'm going to go over here and get a berry, and then I'm going to buy... Hey, what, what, when, you buy use, when you use all your characters, you go back to home. Yep. Let me see. You may play one card. Okay. So I'm going to buy the bank for two resin. That only activates when I buy the critter. The, the banks tell you when they activate. So we're going to put a new card. It is the conductor. Oh, yes. that's a cool card. I, I, I just need one more berry. Okay, well, um, I think it's, you're going to bring all your guys back. Yeah. Okay. So, so it's then, my turn. We're going to pull my guys back. Hold on. No, no. So we're going to, you're going to pass the sun token over to me now. <laughs> here we so go. The moon's going to move over here. Um, so, well, we roll dice and then we uh, do this. So we're going to roll dice. We got two twigs and two of any. That's pretty good. And then um, all of our greens activate. So you're going to get another victory point because you're a captain. And then you can grab any one resource that you want. I can trade a resource. Oh, and get two. I, I should have gotten... Ah, man. This is just from earlier because I, I made a mistake. So I'm going to trade one of my berries. I'm going to trade one of my berries, pay one berry, and then I'm going to get two more berries. Uh, so that's going to give me a total of three berries. Danny, I love trains. I'm sorry, but well, there might be more trains. So what which... Uh, there's what only resource? two trains. Oh, there is? Okay. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. But hey, what resource do you want? Okay. I'm going to get... No, 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 no. From this card, what resource do you want? You can grab any of one resource. You want to grab berries? Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to well, buy... No, 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 no. It's Daddy's turn to go first. Uh, but I... You got to play fair, buddy. Okay. 
But I didn't even buy. That's okay, buddy. You gotta play fair. So I'm not gonna take the conductor away from you. Um, what I will do is I will go here to get any two resources. Now, what do I want to do? Um, you know what? I'm going to grab two resins for now. And then I'm going to buy the farmer. I'm going to pay a grape to get the farmer. And he's going to give me a grape right back because he activates when I buy them. So then I'm going to get a victory point because of my bank. And then we're going to flip this card over, and it is the map maker. It's a cute little bat. Um, he copies the abilities of other uh, any of the dice. So any face the dice is on. That's actually really cool. Okay, it's your turn, bub. Okay, so I'm going to... Hold on, send your guy out first. You have to send your worker out. What do you want to get? Do you want to get some... Well... Well, I didn't even buy anything. Yes, yeah, you, you have to go out, then you buy a card. You send your worker out to, to a special yeah, place. Yeah, I did get my worker no, out. Where, where you, no, no, no. Where, where are you going to send your worker, bud? You put him there to get two twigs? I was going to go there, so that's very smart that you went there. Yeah, and then I'm going to buy. And spend the two berries to buy the conductor. Choo-choo. He's a critter, so why don't you put him up here so you know your critters are up there, okay? Yeah. There you go. And then for the new card, we have the princess. She gives us, at the end of the game, a victory point for every card that has this I only have. I only have one. Yeah. So the cards, they give you the points at the end of the game. You count up these points. And then if there's any bonuses, like the purples all have end of game effects. So it's my turn. And I think I'm going to buy the berry bear. Oh wait, I gotta send a guy out, don't I? Um. Yeah, I'm gonna send you out. I think it looks like berries are the resource that I want right now, so I'm gonna send you out for berries. Hold on, and then I'm gonna spend two berries to buy a berry bear, which is going to give me a victory point because of my bank. And we're gonna draw a new person, so. Oh, it's a treasure hunter, and he uh, he gives you just a victory point. It's a cat. The artwork in this game is fantastic. Go ahead, Chase. Okay. So you send your worker out first. Where do you want your worker to go? Now remember, if you go here, you get a victory point and a one resource. So here's your victory point. You're getting close to five. And you're going to get a berry, huh? Yeah, I want to buy that treasure well, hunter. You maybe don't tell me what you're going to get, okay? Because then I might block you. Mm-mm. Mm. -mm. mm. Mm -mm. So I'm going to send my guy over here to get two berries. Yeah. And then, that's then my I'm going to go buy. Do you know what I'm going to buy? Yeah, that. Map maker, actually. Because <laughs> I like the map maker. Treasure Hunter is a good card, too. And <gasps> we got a pirate ship. Ooh, Ooh that's good. So this, the berries are going to go here. Okay. I, I that's my a... last worker. Oh, oh, and I also get a victory point. I already got... No, I didn't get the victory point yet. One, two, yep, so this will be my third victory point because of my bank. Instead, I want that. Oh, when you bought your conductor, buddy, you get a resource. So pick a resource. I'm sorry, we forgot about that. Okay. So any one resource. So you can get a berry and buy your uh, treasure hunter if you want, but that's up to you. You do what you want to do. Mm. Yes. Okay, you're going to send your last worker out. Gonna go get some more twigs, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Never know you might need them. Now I'm good. You're gonna buy the pirate ship? Yeah. Well, that's a cool ship. There we go. If I can get it, so it's gonna go here. The pirate. See? It allows me every resources. Two resources. Two of any resources, yep. Okay, well, we're gonna flip over on that. We're gonna flip over this. Ooh. It's a toad barge. Every time you um, he activates, uh, you get a twig. Okay. I got, Hold I on. got it. Well, guess what? It's going to be the sun marker is gonna go to you. Yes. You're gonna roll the die. Yes. So I go first. Yep. Oh, we oh we bring our workers back. Bring all of our workers back home. Well, we are now 
over halfway through the game. Yeah, all I need is Hold one on. more. Do you have? No, you have. Yep, you you need one more one, building. Two, three. Yeah, you need one more building. Nice, you're going on this, and I need two more. Well, um, well, we're that gonna roll that. Yep, we're gonna re-roll that. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, two berries and two resin. So, oh, and this guy's gonna come back here, and he's gonna go there. Okay, my turn. Yep. Um, first of all, don't forget this moved, so all the greens activate. You're gonna get your fifth hero, uh, your fifth uh, point. So we're gonna trade out those fours and give you one of these. Woohoo! And then you get any resource that you want. So go ahead and go pick a resource. My farmer is gonna give me a berry. Say. And then I can trade any one resource. For more resources, so I'm going to trade one berry, and I'm going to get two more berries. I'm going. I'm going to get this twig. <laughs> okay. Okay, my turn. Yep, you do get to go first. I'm going to use to get a toad. Oh, you got the toad. <laughs> oh, and now we got an orchard. Orchard. No, that's What's a building. It cost a twig. I got a twig. And you don't. No, I don't. Huh. Well, I think you're going to be able to get the orchard, which means you're going to get the five buildings before I do. Um, but you know what? I think I'm going to go ahead. Let's see. If I can get two berries. Yeah, I think the two berries is going to be the way I'm just going to have to go about it. So I'm going to put my guy here. I'm going to take two berries, and then I'm going to immediately buy the treasure hunter for those two berries. So I'm going to actually put it kind of up here. This will still be in my stack, but that way it's still visible. And we're going to draw a new one. <gasps> we got the prince. Thanks. Yep. And then I get a treasure. I get two of these, which puts me up to five. I get one for the treasure hunter and then one for my bank. So now I have five victory points. Yeah, but I got five too. Yep. So it's a close game. Anybody can win. Okay. Hold on, so, um, did I get my, yeah, I did get my berry. Okay, so now it's your turn. So where are you going to send your worker? Hmm. So I get two resources, two in each. Oh, yeah, it's because you're a pirate ship, so what are you going to get? Resin, that's a good, that's a good one. And resin. Okay, so I'm going to get Only cost a twig. Oh, and that's going to be your fifth building. So do you know what that means? Yes. You get to claim this for your parade. So we'll put this over here. Uh, We're going to put it right here. Or I'm sure I like it. You can put it right here if you want. I like it right here. Okay. Okay. So, yeah, that put you uh, had a really good lead. Mm -hmm. We're going to flip over to see what kind of new card we got. Oh, we got a queen. Queen. She gives you one point for every parade. Try I like it over here. What do I want to do? That, 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 that. You know what? I think I'm going to buy the toy maker. Why? So, because uh, I like the toy maker. I'm going to buy that castle. We got to wonder. Okay. Uh, so this gives me five animals, which lets me take this parade. Okay. So. so my turn. Yep. So my last person. Oh, did I send a guy out to work? I did not. I would have sent you... You know what? I'm going to put you on my map maker and take two berries. Copying that dice ability. Okay, it's my turn. Yep. I'm sorry about that. Go ahead. My turn. I'm going to get a berry. Ooh. What are you going to get? I'm going to... I'm going to get the castle. Ooh, the castle. The castle gives you a victory point for every green area you have. What are those things called, those resources? I have six buildings now. Yeah, green card. So for every green card. Okay, yep, that's fine. I go. I go. I got okay, six. Okay, and then what's going to replace the castle is the dance floor. Ooh. Ooh. Damn? Dance floor. Okay. Okay, hold on, let so me see. It. No, 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 it's not your turn yet. That, that. I still have the sun. Well, you know what? 
I think that actually kind of clears up one thing that I want to do. Let's see. Okay, so I'll send you over here to collect two resin. And then what I'll do is I'll just take one because I'm going to buy that dance floor. My turn. Yep. And then, oh, we got a glider. This gives you a res. Oh, I think that's the end of the round. Is it? Yeah, that's the end of the round. No. Everybody's gone. Ooh. We are now in the last round here. Let's bring our workers back home. We're down to the last round. Yeah, this has gone fast, hasn't it? It's time. Oh. Okay, well, hold on. I get to roll the dice. And you give me the sun, please. Oh, we got two wild resources and two berries. And then all of our greens activate. So you are going to get a victory point. You're going to get a grape or a berry and a twig because you got the barge. And you get one of any resource. So go ahead and claim whatever the resource barge? you want. You got the orchard. Um, so you got the orchard and the barge. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. You have one, two. Yeah, yeah you, got, you got five buildings. Okay. No, no, no. Wait. I got six. Yeah, you got six buildings. So um, I get a victory point. I get a berry. And I can trade one resource for any two resources. Let me see what we got here. I kind of like my berries, so I'm going to trade one berry and get two berries back. Okay. Did you pick your resource? Yeah. yeah. You, but remember, you get any resource because of your fort? Oh, yeah. Any? Mm-hmm. Okay, so we got one, two, we got, okay, so we got footprint, got that, we got the green card. Okay, so I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to send you over here to give me two of any resources. Um, everything's berry, so I'm going to grab two berries, I guess. Okay. Hold on. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to buy the inventor because he gives me one of each resource. He's a critter, so I get a victory point. So it's going to cost me three berries to buy the inventor. And I get a victory point. We're going to see what else comes up. And plus, I get one of each resource because those things activate right away. It's a zip line. It costs three twigs. Here's the thing, though. I meet this criteria, so I'm going to take that one. And I'm going to get a resin. Oh. <laughs> my my butterfly w didn't come home from the pirate ship. Oh, okay. Yeah, make sure you're catching that. Good job, buddy. Okay. Well, it's now your turn to send your worker out to work. It, so it's my turn? Yep. So. Let's see. I'm going to get two Wait, do berries. I have... Oh, I'm sorry. I also missed a requirement for this one, too, because I have three of the paw prints. So I just need... I, I, got, I got one, two. I got two paw prints. Yep. Uh, and you also have two scrolls. So if you get another scroll or a paw print, you can grab this one. And then you, grab need, that one? you need one of these little one of these little icons here, and you can get this one. That's and then you okay. need a bunch of more critters. So what, what are you going to do? I'm going to bomb like this. Okay, and he gives you any one resource of your choice. So we got a fort builder. Each building costs one less resource. Ooh, that's pretty good. Oh. oh. Um, <laughs> see, I need buildings, but I think... Uh, so what resource do you want to uh, get? Since uh, you got the wonder? I got, I got the wonder, so yeah. I get this one. No, no, you get... Yeah, you do get that one. You're correct. And then what resource do you want? Because you did get the Wanderer, so he gives you one resource. So pick one of these resources and take it. Since everything's burning, I would take That's the That's smart, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the zip line's a building. So what I'm going to do, because I kind of want some buildings now, is I'm going to send you over to here to my map maker. I'm going to copy this one, and it's going to give me two twigs. And I'm going to build a zip line. 
And it's going to give me four buildings. So if I can manage to get one more building, which I'm not seeing any, okay. uh, then I will be able to get... Oh, it's a sweep. Unfortunately, that's not a building right now. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that one. And he's a sweep. He copies any one of the... Um, any one of the green abilities. So I think I know what I'm going to do, but it's your turn, bud. Okay. So I'm going to get pay two berries. Well, were you moving your guy first? And then. Remember, you could go to your, your uh, pirate ship, or you can go to your hideout and get a victory point as well. Do you want to do that? Get a twig and a victory point. My go. pirate ship? Yep, your pirate. Uh, your hideout. Your hideout. Yes. And there you go. Look at that. And I get a card. So that's going to let you get <gasps> yes. this one. Yuck. It's a playground. Playground. The I playground says for every green card you play, you get a resource. Now, I don't have a way of getting enough twigs to get the playground. I have enough Twigs. Oh, I do actually. I'm going to go to the toy maker because this gives me five victory points. So it gives me eight ultimately. So I'm going to go get the two twigs and I'm going to spend the resin that I would need to buy the playground to give me the uh, buff of the playground. <laughs> I need that, Danny. I'm sorry, but I needed it too because since that gives me a building, <gasps> like there's a feast. Ooh, yeah. that is really cool. So since I got the playground though, I do claim the final parade okay my turn yep this is the last turn place your last guy you can put him on your pirate ship and get two of any resources if you want it's okay i just need one you just need one toy okay okay you're gonna buy the feast so you grabbed the feast did you get your two berries uh, no okay well, in the last card, it doesn't really matter because we are done. Hey, look, it's a toy shop. Toy shop? That's really cute. Yeah. Okay, so now the game is over. We're going to pull our workers back. And flap, 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 so we get to flap, enjoy flap. our parade. Okay, so we're going to count up our victory points. We'll be right Wait. back with the winner. Eight. You got a nice feast there. That's really cool. Yeah, but do I get this one? Um. Let's see. You already got that one. No, let's see. No, this one. Uh, let's see. I think you do. You got that. You got that. You got paw prints, right? You got a paw prints. You got this flower. You got that. Yep, that, you would have gotten that one last turn. Good job, buddy. There's your parade. Yay! Okay. Chase, how many points did you have? 53. And I had 60. So, so what actually made up the difference for me was getting the dance floor and then getting the zip line. That's actually what gave me the victory. I was really close. Chase almost won. So good job, yeah. buddy. I just happened to get lucky yeah. at the end. Yeah, I... Yeah. It's, I'm gonna pick out the other cards. Well, okay. Uh, Chase, before you do that, I will do that when we tear down, okay? Why don't you tell me what you thought of this game? Um, I like the pirate ship, the secret hideout, the jail, the treehouse, the cast. Do you like the game? Oh. Yes, and I love this, this, <laughs> yeah. this, 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 It's got this, beautiful this. artwork. Um, how do you think this game compares to some other games that we played? Do you like this more or less? I love this more because it has my favorite things on it. Do you like the artwork? I Don't you I think like, the critters look really cool? Yeah, but I love, I love, it's so funny when they eat the apple on a tree. Yeah. So this was my first time ever playing this game, by the way. So if I got anything kind of wrong, I'm sorry. I think I was mainly right on the rolls. Uh, but I played Everdale a couple of times, and yeah. I, I like Everdale. And then, um, what were you going to say? Yeah, but it, there's a real way for playing this, I think. Well, I think we played pretty close. So Everdale is fun, and this is a great light version of Everdale that's good for kids. Um, I'm looking forward to when Chase can play with us, um, the real Everdale. The, um, the, the, you know, the bigger Everdale. But this is a really good introduction to it. The mechanics are boiled down, but they are roughly the same. So I'm really, really impressed with this. Um, as with everything Everdale, their quality is always through the roof. And this is no exception. The art is very solid. It's got all the charm that the original game has. And uh, just a really fun game. 
it flows really, really well. You saw we were just able to play it very smoothly back and forth. Uh, but yeah, so I think we both like it. We both would recommend yeah. it. Uh, so we wanted to say thank you so much for watching. And until next time. Bye. Take the initiative and. Roll out. See ya.